the apple of my eye, my collabo queen You the only one I want on my team, if you know what I mean We go together like coffee and cream, I'm intertwined in your daily routine Hey guys, what's up? So, I don't know about you, but on my date nights, I love to go all in with my shower and beauty prep routine So I'm going to show you guys exactly what I do to really get ready for a date night so you guys know I love to listen to music when I get ready. I actually have a specific shower mood playlist that I created on Apple Music. I'll actually link this down below for you guys if you want to check it out. It's just a bunch of songs that make me feel confident, that get me excited and pumped. Like I mentioned, this shower routine is extremely extensive because my man likes it all natural, you know what I'm saying? So I go in on my skincare, my body care, shaving, hair, literally everything. So I have a long playlist for this. Once I have my music all set up and ready, I usually wash my hair inside the shower, but just to save some time, I went ahead and already shampooed using my Lush Wasabi Shine Cool Shampoo and I'm actually just going to go ahead and put in a hair mask so that way it can sit while I'm in the shower. I really like the Hairfinity Strengthening Amino Mask. This mask gives me moisture, gives me strength. It literally gets my curls just popping so I love to use this when I know I need my hair looking good because it's a win-win. It's always going to work. So I'm just detangling my hair so that way I can let the mask sit while I'm in the shower and it just saves time so I don't have to do all this in the shower. I'm already doing enough in the shower. So I'm just going to throw on a plastic shower cap to trap some heat and then I'm going to wrap it up in my hair turban so that the heat stays in and the mask can do its job. So now I'm gonna go ahead and hop in the shower. The first thing I have to do is cleanse and exfoliate my skin. I need my skin nice and smooth and glowy, okay? I've been really loving this Teamy Blends Green Tea Facial Scrub. You guys saw me use a few videos back. It's actually really thick, so I kinda apply it like a face mask. I first just put like a big glob of it all over my skin, and then I just use my hands to massage the exfoliating beads. So this mask is actually really gentle. You can use it every day. It has sugar, lemongrass, and matcha green tea. So once I'm done massaging that into my skin, I'm just going to use some water to rinse it off. And that was not a snot bubble, by the way. That was just a bubble formed from the cleanser. So now it's time to get my lips kissing ready. I love the honey lip scrub from Lush. You guys can see mine is like all dingy and scratched up now because it's kind of old, but it still works well. Y'all, this lip scrub tastes so good. It has white chocolate, vanilla, and honey. It also has jojoba oil that helps to soften your lips. You can actually lick this scrub off because it is all natural but I just use some water to wipe it off. I don't eat it. <laughs> so now it's time to cleanse my body. On date night I like to use something nice and sweet smelling so I'm going to use this Love Beauty and Planet Muramuru Butter and Rose Body Wash. This stuff is so moisturizing. The fragrance is like really nice and sweet and flirty. It has like rose notes with some berry in it and I love Love Beauty and Planet in general because their products are super natural. They're free, paraben free, silicone free, sulfate free, they're cruelty free, vegan, all ethically sourced and just a really great brand. I've used this African sponge in a couple of my previous shower routine videos but if you don't know this is basically like an exfoliating cloth. I love it because the net really helps to smooth and soften my skin. So after washing everything off of course I'm just going to rinse and my skin is left feeling nice and soft and smelling nice and sweet. So next you guys already know my holy grail. This is the Honey Pot Normal Feminine Foaming Wash. I know I say this in all of my videos, but I know a lot of people feel like your cookie cleanses itself, which the inside does, but the outside does not. So I just like to use this to prevent an overgrowth of bacteria to make myself feel nice and clean and fresh. This company is black owned and it is made with 99% natural ingredients. This formula has apple cider vinegar to help balance and maintain a healthy pH. It also has coconut oil, which helps to fight bacteria and moisturize naturally. And it has some other great things too, like lavender and grapefruit seed extract. And if you're a little bit more sensitive, they do have a more sensitive formula. I'll link the website down below, but I like to use the normal wash. It works really well for me. And I use it every day too, like not just on date night. So now I'm going to prep my skin to shave. I always like to exfoliate before shaving. I'm going to use the raw sugar sugar scrub. This is the regular coconut oil one. This is literally my favorite exfoliating scrub. I really only use this to exfoliate my legs because that's where I'm going to be shaving. I also shave my underarms, so sometimes I'll use it on my underarms too, but today I just use it on my legs. If you 
you don't exfoliate your skin before you shave, you're making a big mistake because let me tell you, it will change the way your shave is. It makes my shave feel so much smoother. I never get ingrown hairs. It helps to get rid of any dead skin. So that way you have a nice smooth base in order to shave. So now after rinsing that off, it is time to get ready to shave. If you saw my previous shower routine, then you know that I'm obsessed with this brand called Flamingo. So I am really excited to be partnering with them to show you guys this really cute shave set that you can get. Flamingo is actually a new body care line that makes high quality effective products for women with hair aka us and all of their products are cruelty free without parabens or sulfates. So basically inside this kit you'll get the razor as well as a five blade cartridge already on it. You'll also get a travel size aftershave body lotion. You'll also get a travel size of their shaving foam. You'll get this cute little shower hook where you can hang your razor in and you'll get an extra five blade cartridge. So I'm going to show you guys how I use the razor to shave. It's crazy because I actually just kind of came across this brand randomly at Target and bought it and fell in love with it. I love the blade because it bends so it makes it super easy to get a nice close shave. I actually already own the full size of the foaming shave gel so I'm gonna use mine instead of using the travel size one today. I'm gonna save that for traveling but I love this foaming gel because it is so nice and cushiony. It makes my skin feel so smooth and it allows the blade to just glide on my skin to get the perfect shave. I like the fact that it's not really heavy so it makes it easy to clean out of the blade after using it. It has aloe vera and conditioning emollients to make the skin nice and soft. In my last shower routine video, I got so many questions on why I shaved down instead of shaving up. This is just way better for the skin. It's better to shave in the direction that the hair grows. It prevents ingrown hairs. It prevents scratching. In all honesty, it feels unnatural to do it this way at first, but you get used to the motion. I love this razor as well because the grip handle is so firm. I don't feel like I'm gonna drop it. I don't feel like I'm gonna accidentally press too hard on my skin. I really only shave my legs and my underarms. Everyone has their preference on what makes them feel most comfortable. So yeah, I highly recommend these products. And arguably the best thing about this is that it is extremely affordable. I usually spend like $25 to $30 just on one razor alone but with this set you can actually get it for just $16 I got y'all I got a 25% off link down below in my description box the value of this set is $22 but if you use my link you'll get it for just 16 and it literally comes with six items so next now that I'm done shaving it's time to moisturize my skin I like to use this really lightweight body oil from Olivia care it's their jasmine and gardenia scent Again, I love sweet, flirty scents on date night and specifically my man doesn't really like greasy lotions and stuff so I know that when we're gonna be all cuddled up I like to use a lightweight oil that gets my skin smooth but doesn't leave a residue plus I live in Miami and it's really hot even though it's November it's still hot and so just in general I like to use lightweight moisturizers on my skin this oil is so rich in vitamins and omega fatty acids and it has a nice rose scent and let me tell you guys, using this oil on my legs after shaving, my skin be glowing. It just feels so soft and hydrated and I smell good. Can't beat that. So next, so last but not least for the body care, I had to hydrate my feet. I love to use my Bliss of Grease Foot Balm. It is like so extra to use a different moisturizer for your feet than you do for the rest of your body. But this foot balm was literally created to help with dry feet. It's 100% natural and organic. It's a super smooth cold pressed butter. It has extra virgin olive oil, sweet almond oil, grapeseed oil, lavender oil, vitamin E oil. It's super hydrating. It helps to get rid of cracked heels and tough calluses. Even if you don't suffer from dry feet, this is really good to use to help maintain the health of the skin on your feet. It's also antibacterial and antifungal, so it'll make your feet smell really good too. So now I'm pretty much done with my body care. It's time to move on to my hair. Since I've already put in my hair mask, all I have to do is style my hair. So I'm just going to take off my turban and take off my plastic cap and rinse out the hair mask. So I'm very particular. I think about every little thing if you haven't already noticed. So on a date night, I know that my man is gonna play in my hair. So I have to make sure that I'm using products that's gonna make my hair soft. I love to use the Miss Jessie's Honey Curls as my 
like leave-in conditioner it really hydrates and conditions my hair and I have to use a gel that's gonna define my curls but still leave them nice and soft so of course I'm gonna reach for my eco styler gel I like to use the one with Jamaican black castor oil as you guys can see mine is like almost empty this is my go-to gel it's just a gel that I know is gonna define my curls and leave them nice and soft and shiny if you have a go-to styling gel comment them down below because I would love to add some more to my arsenal because some gels are really good but they leave a cast or they make my hair feel crunchy which is not something that I want on a date night so yeah I'm just going to finish up with styling the rest of my curls something new that I've been trying because I'm always trying new techniques but something new I've been trying is actually drying my hair in a t-shirt before I get out the shower to help with the drying process so that way I don't have to blow dry and this is so funny that this is actually a date night video because I actually took this t-shirt from my boyfriend <laughs> but yeah I just lightly put it over my curls and then I'll use a clip to hold it in place and it does not leave my hair frizzy which I love so now I'm gonna hop out of the shower and we're not done yet <laughs> I'm going to use my all-time favorite deodorant this is the cashmere mist deodorant from Donna Karen I've literally used this in like every single one of my hygiene videos so if you don't know I don't know what you've been doing but this is the best deodorant ever to finish up with my skin routine I'm going to use my pixie skin treats glow tonic as my toner now typically my boyfriend doesn't like makeup not that I wear it for him but if I'm going on a date with him I really like that I can just wear my skin and feel my best and he likes it that way so I have to make sure that my skin is on 10 so that I feel comfortable with it I really like this glow glyconic boost face mask from pixie as well it's like a sheet mask on days where I know that I don't want to wear makeup this will give me that instant glow I kind of use this as my serum step so it has herbal extracts that helps to brighten the skin it also has collagen and peptides that helps to improve the skin elasticity so it feels nice and tight and of course it has glyconic acid which helps to brighten and gently exfoliate your skin so I'll pretty much just leave this on for about 10 to 15 minutes and then I'll take it off and the remaining um, serum on my face I just press it into my skin and like I said it just leaves me feeling nice and glowy so now it's time to moisturize my skin I'm going to use the Bobbi Brown vitamin enriched face base I love to use this whenever I am not wearing makeup because I have like combination skin so my t-zone tends to get a little bit oily this helps to balance my skin and give me a nice like semi matte finish and also sometimes when I do decide to wear like a little bit of makeup this is a great base for if you're just going to be wearing powder. So lastly for my face, I'm going to use my Fenty Beauty Pro Kisser Lip Balm. This is like my favorite lip balm ever now. It literally moisturizes my lips so well and actually does prep them for kissing because it tastes good too. <laughs> so next, this is so extra as well, but I have to have soft hands. I'm going to use this hand lotion from Lush. It is so silky and smooth. It has some great ingredients like almond and pumpkin seed butter. It also has rose water and organic shea butter. And just a quick tip, I'm applying this to my hands, but I'm also going to apply it to all the areas where I'm going to spray perfume because this helps the scent to actually stay longer. I'm going to use my Versace Bright Crystals perfume. I get compliments on this perfume everywhere that I wear it and my boyfriend actually bought this for me for my birthday last year so I'm just going to spritz that on my wrist I'm also going to spritz it like along my chest area and now I'm all ready and sweet smelling I'm just going to take down my hair and since I can go all natural I don't really have to do much else so hopefully you guys enjoyed this I will be linking all the products that I use down below don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and hopefully I'll see you guys all in the next one bye